As the whole nation celebrates the National Voters Day, the state of Meghalaya also joined hands in celebrating this day at Raj Bhavan Shillong. Speaking at the program, the Honorable Governor of Meghalaya, Sri Satyapal Malik, says that it is a matter of pride to the state as the office of the Chief Electoral Office of the state was awarded with the national award entitled Best Electoral Practices by the State Commission of India for its, for its standard and systematic practice in 2018 Assembly elections. The Honorable Governor also applauded the CEO office for the rise in the numbers of voters in the state by 2.59 percent. Conduct of elections, registration of voters, preparation of electoral rules, voters awareness campaign and various other related programs under the direct supervision of the Election Commission of India. It is a matter of pride that Office of CEO Meghalaya was awarded National Award for Best Electoral Practices by Election Commission of India for its conduct of 2018 Assembly elections. It is noteworthy that the department continues to actively implement the voter awareness programs for promoting electoral literacy in the state with a special focus on intensive EVM, VEPAT awareness, workshop for media, judicial officers, lawyers and judges of high court and other stakeholders. It is indeed encouraging to learn that this year due to COVID-19, online voter education is being carried out to online electoral literacy, literacy clubs to prepare young and future voters of the country. It is a good sign that voting percentage overall has increasingly two point increase, increased by 2.59% in the last elections compared to the previous elections with female voter turnout going up by 3.5%. I expect that with these higher enrollments and voter turnouts, the innovative and creative campaigns initiated, including an excessive election, achieved widened stakeholder engagements, made an involvement of poor volunteers, peaceful, free and fair elections, and the overall successful conduct at the recently held elections, new benchmarks in electoral management are being set for the coming years.